post-signing an agreement because I just don't think, regardless of using IP or any of those things, I just don't think you're going to get, uh, and you know, Kaylee, chip in if you think I'm wrong, I just don't think you're going to get that magnitude of funds which would require big institutions to go through a due diligence process mm-hmm. where we have presented a large backlog of funds as the priority funding above growth mm-hmm. in our good work. Yeah. I, I, we we can't uh, we wouldn't be able to get get around that. And for me on Friday, you know, stark realization is when you step back from the conversations that that that, were, that we had is is that we have to take the temperature check of the UK climate from a um, a journalist who represents the sort of like the, the popular culture and what is what is known and what is understood and what is discussed. B a representative from a leading UK corporate foundation and C. Uh, an individual with um, significant um, influence contacts and, um, you know, a history in philanthropy. And for me, that sort of sums up, you know, the, the risk, the risk that, we, that, that we're looking at here um, from, from the positions that, 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 those, ind- you know, that those individuals have. Um, pa- what Patrick said is absolutely correct, I'm afraid. I can't... I can't lie around it, and I think one of the first things I struggled with when I arrived here was the real, you know, the concept that I was potentially fundraising for a debt. Um, I, I had some real problems with that, um, but we've been able to push that aside because of the, the you know, the, the, the position that we're in. Um, we have to have a coherent position moving forward and a clear explanation to UK funders as to why we. Are in the position that we ever that we land or that we choose on. Um, Captain Michael here just um, wants to dispel a, a, um, a myth about the um, about Inc and their their fundraising for uh, for the UK charity. Uh, I mean, going back uh, to an earlier period when the relationship was very very strong, uh, there was always an ask. Uh, you know, can you help with fundraising contacts? Um, right in the early days, I think they were they participated a little bit in the Bamel in Bamel coming on board, uh, and and with Bain Cap. But um, there's been absolutely nothing uh, since then, despite you know kind of continual conversation about you know how can you help? Who can you introduce us to? So, just want to sort of set that in context. It's not as if they have a whole bunch of funders who they could. Uh, you know, immediately and quickly open us up to. No, the most recent uh, introduction suggested to me at the, meet, the, the visit just before Christmas, I followed up on, and, and I'd, I'm sorry that they've led nowhere. So. Uh, who else hasn't? Has everyone on the call expressed a, a, a view, I think, so far? Yeah. I think looking down my list, I think everybody has. Um, well, we're, we're there, it's clear there are two fairly, uh, although we may all agree with what's required at the end of it, there are, there's quite strong disagreements about the route to that. Um, Charlie, do you have any suggestions about how we well, take this forward? I, I mean, I, I mean I, is it possible, actually, without drawing any implication of this, that, that we have a conversation without the SLT hearing it, because I, yes, I think there is a route, um, and it just might be easier, but... Okay, well, yeah, let's... Uh, may have a view on that, I don't know. Uh, does, anyone, does anyone want to have any uh, additional conversation with SLT at this point, or should we ask them to drop off? Uh, and I'd say they've been enormously helpful to me in what they've said. Uh, I think it's extremely helpful. Thank you. Um, uh, Michael, Kaylee, Craig, Gordon, anything else to add before we ask you to drop off? No, but I, I mean... Thank you, thank you. Oh, thanks, Absolutely. guys. I mean, yeah. none of this is easy for us. This isn't... We're all, you know, professionals. No one ever had, you know, in mind that we would be here in this position and yet we're only pushing ourselves to be in this position because of all the reasons we've already outlined and I won't go into again. But our ultimate concern at the moment is time. It's a word we mm. keep saying, but... Yeah. And we're, we're ready to act on recommendations, so, yeah. you know. Um, okay, thank you. Thank you. Thank you.
you know, yeah. whatever we decide is not a reflection on you guys and we're all behind you. We That's fine. Forward. Mm -hmm. And then we've got to be wholly practical as well, so, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thanks very much. Okay, Thank you all very much. Just, just please remember our staff, we're trying, whatever decision we take, whatever course we take, mm. we've got to look after them in, in the kindest possible way. Thank you. Thank you. right. Yeah, thank you right. Thank you, OK. Uh, Michael, Cayley, Craig, Gordon, could be able to do the drop off there. Thank yeah. you. Thank you, will do now. Yeah, thank you, bye-bye. Hmm. I'm always paranoid about